Hello everyone. I am here with some concepts regarding with the clock. As we all know, the clock has three hands: minute hand, hour hand, and second hand. Before we actually start solving problems on angles, we need to know couple of basic facts. Clear. First one is speed of the hour hand. Speed of the hour hand is equal to point five degree per minute. Mean to say, hour hand it cover three sixty degree angle in twelve hour. In one hour, it covers an angle of thirty degree, and in one minute, it covers an angle of point five degree. Similarly, the minute hand, the speed of minute hand, is equal to six degree per minute. Mean to say. minute hand it revolves 360 degree angle in 60 minutes in 1 minute it covers 60 degree angle second one the hands of a clock they are perpendicular to each other for 22 times in 12 hour and 44 times in a day Between two to three, between two to three, the hands they are perpendicular ones, and between eight to nine, both hands they are perpendicular to each other ones. The hands of a clock are opposite to each other for eleven times in twelve hour. And twenty-two times in a day. Between five to seven, both hands they are opposite to each other, once in a day. Once in twelve hours, mean to say. The minute hand gain fifty-five minutes over hour hand per hour. Mean to say, x minute space to be gained by minute hand over hour hand can be calculated as. X into sixty over fifty-five. Let's take some examples to illustrate this concept. First one is what is the angle between the hands of a clock at seven twenty? Now suppose we want to find the an angle between hour hand and minute hand. So at seven o'clock the hour hand is at two ten degree. From the vertical, why? Because hour hand to move seven hour plus twenty minutes, and minute hand to move only twenty minutes. The movement of hour hand is equal to two ten seven into thirty plus twenty into point five. That is two twenty. On other hand, minute hand. They have to move only twenty minutes. Mean to say, twenty into six that is one twenty, and we have to find the angle between these two hands. The difference between the angle two twenty and one twenty will give the angle between the hour hand and minute hand. We have some. formula tricky formula which is very useful to find the angle between hour hand and minute hand the angle between hour hand and minute hand is equal to h into 30 minus m into 5.5 here h means hours m mean minutes angle between hands at 530 here h is 5 and m is 30 just place the value plug and play and you will get the angle between The hands at five thirty is fifty 
15 degree here h is 5 m is 30 then m into 30 is equal to 150 30 into 5.5 is 1.165 and their difference it should be always positive that's why mod is here therefore angle between hands at 530 is 15 degree one more trick this is very useful to find the right angle the right angle at which each other by hands of clock between 1 hour is given by absolute value 5x plus minus 15 into 12 upon 11 for example at what time do the hands of a clock between 7 and 8 form 90 degrees so we have two possibilities number one 7 to 8 here x is 7 now 5 into 7 minus 15 into 12 over 11 you will have 240 over 11 solve it you will get 21 minutes and 9 by 11 of the minute case number 2 plus case or minus case 5 plus 5 into 7 plus 15 into 12 over 11 that will be equal to 1600 over 11 and which is equal to 54 and 6 by 11 minute so the hand of clock they are at 90 degree at the following times 721 and 754 this formula is very useful one more for the coinciding the hands between 1 hour 5x into 12 over 11 that is at what time do the hands of a clock meet 7 and 8 here x is 7 just place the value you will get 420 over 11 divide it you will have 38 and 2 by 11 minutes mean to say after 38 minutes past 7 that is 738 and 2 by 11 both will coincide each other and these formulas they are very useful to understand the concept of clocks. Thank you.